Okay, just a recording of number 11 Pleasant Drive. I'm just downstream from an I.O. that's been dug up. Um, yeah, I'm actually pushing something along towards the tank, so I'm just going to um, yeah, drop down. There's an access along here that I'll drop down and get a bit closer at it. So it was first wedged in just here. Um, you can see all this pipe work all looks good. It's only again until we get back up the start here, there's sort of some weird step up where they used to have the old septic tank and now they run into a Aussie clean. We'll see it in a second. There you can see we're stepping right up through there, so it actually holds sort of a quarter of the pipe of water. You see once we go back upstream we're all good. So that's sort of an easy easy fix. Yeah, so I'm just going to go down the side over here now. We would have come past this before.
Did you push, push it through? Yeah, yeah, so I sent that, sent that big head back down there, mm -hmm. all the way to the tank. Mm -hmm. And then now I've just sort of blasted a load of water through there, so we'll have, a, we'll have another look now and make sure it's gone. a little bit of a, an elbow, obviously straightening this mm -hmm. sort of up to go towards the tank. Well, there's bits of it. See before that was just sort of one big, I'll push this down to the that food? No, what it looks, it actually looks like in the old septics you'd get like a scowl build up mm -hmm. on, on the outlet mm -hmm. and I reckon it looks quite sort of yeah, it's definitely not grease and fat it looks like sort of the the scowl from the old from the old septic tank. from the old septic that's what well, it, if you can push that through, that should clear no more problems then. No, and that, that'll be a... Well, obviously this in there's not doing you any favours whatsoever. Um, so then what we'll sort of do from there is then get a good indication. So there's the... There's your inlet to the tank there. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, so that's mm. the... So mm -hmm. what's, what's actually happened is that pipe's dropped a little bit just before the tank there. And see once we go over that join there, you can mm. see how much that sort of dropped. So we have to put in the tank. There was a lot of rain. Yeah. And a hole where the tank was in, you know, caved in all around it. Yeah. And that'll the, be the tank wouldn't move itself on solid rock at the bottom, I think, but but the ground all around it settled quite a bit. Yeah, and that's and that's probably what sort of caused that just to mm -hmm. drop that little bit. Was that my U trap? Hey, <laughs> did you see my U uh, O ring? Oh, was that was that the O ring? Just there, there, it is there. there. It is, yeah. Hook onto that and pull it out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, isn't it? Good camera you got there. <laughs> Shows my boo boos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it. Oh, that'll eventually just yeah. find its way into the yeah. into the tank there. Yeah. Give the people cleaning out the tank something to think yeah. about. What the heck that's was it. that? <laughs> but no, it's a lot. Yeah, I reckon it's small. More been that big chunk of scale than anything. Yeah, I think that's what it looks like. Because just the way it sort of like broke down as well.